Welcome to the Cornwall Reports News Briefing for Tuesday the 10th of May. The local media headlines today. Now what do you think about second homes? Maybe you are a second homeowner and now worried about the prospect of having your council tax doubled. Or maybe you just can't afford to live in the village where you grew up because two thirds of the homes there are now empty for most of the year. Today's Queen's speech looks set to further fuel the debate, which should be good news for tax accountants. The St Ives MP Derek Thomas is risking a black mark by saying that tax alone won't fix the problem. He wants planning reforms too. A related issue is the possibility of a compulsory registration scheme for everyone who provides holiday accommodation. I suppose if you wanted to be treated like a proper industry, it's not unreasonable to say you should act like one. Cornwall Council's facing criticism for not offering free bus passes to Ukrainian refugees who otherwise have no way of travelling to seek work. And there are some very nice new jobs now on offer at County Hall, some with salaries of well over £100,000 a year. It seems like only yesterday that Cornwall Council was making more than 400 of its workers redundant. The Falmouth Packet reported a County Hall initiative to make it easier to get rid of unwanted rigid plastics. Several household waste recycling centres in Cornwall now have new skips to take larger items which had previously been harder to get rid of. The BBC told how the skipper of a fishing charter boat from Mevagissi encourages clients to donate their catch to a local food bank. Parrot FM says some local councillors are worried about county halls borrowing. The Cornish Times warns motorists heading into Plymouth to watch out for the first local 20 mile an hour speed camera and finally Cornwall Live kept its eyes open for the warmest place of the day. And those are the local media headlines for now. Thank you very much for watching. Do please share this video on social media. I'll be back again tomorrow. See you then. Bye bye.